Hello, YouTubers. Just got something in the mail today from uh, American Radio Supply. Just want to show you guys what I'm up to with these little connectors here. So I've got um, several shortwave radios here in the shack, um, and I want to all share share an antenna with them all. And uh, I looked on online for um, combiners, splitters, multi duplexers, whatever you want to call them. And they're, they're not cheap. I saw some for uh, about 180 bucks a piece, and that's just to split it two ways. Well, I've got a cheaper way to do this. What you want to do is just find a TV splitter. And this one will do, except if you look uh, really closely at the uh, frequency frequency range of the splitter and this is important this one goes from 5 megahertz to six, uh, uh, 16 that's really small 1 one gigahertz so 5 megahertz to 1 gigahertz if all you want to listen to in that range then something like this is perfectly fine the only problem is these cable connectors so here we go. We go to uh, American Radio Supply, and I bought these adapters. So there is a cable connector there, and we just connect it in here, and there we go. And look, there's an SO239 on there. This is perfect. This is a much cheaper way to solve this problem. Like I say, the only issue is you've got to uh, you want to use a high quality splitter, cable splitter, and you want to make sure that frequency range is within what you're interested in. Um, I'm going to find a different one. I, I need to go quite a bit below 5 megahertz for my purposes. And they also need to split three ways. But there's the general idea. And you can actually use these to uh, in two different ways. You can use them in both directions. So you can split this way with your radios, one, two radios, one antenna. Or do it the other way around. One radio, two antennas. The, the, both antennas are going to be connected simultaneously though and uh, who knows how that's that's going to be a little bit unpredictable as to how that's going to work for you but these two will be isolated electronically from one another um, even in the case when it's two radios and that's the whole point of doing this is that you're splitting the signal each is uh, going to have 3.5 dB down from the main signal but you're isolating the radios from one another and uh, any noise that they create. So I'll let you know how this works out um, when I get a better splitter. I'm sure I've got a few kicking around the house and uh, I'll, I'll feature these um, in future videos. Um, there's Tom Burton's card W4ALK from American Radio Supply that got this stuff to me within like a couple of days so I uh, hope you enjoyed the video guys um, you might want to try this out yourself let me know how it goes for you